On this short video, I'm going to show some examples of rounding decimals to the nearest place value. So here's one example, um, 17 and 14 hundredths. If we needed to round this to the nearest whole number, that means I want to round to the ones digit, the ones place value. So whatever it's asking you to round to, you want to underline that place value. You always look next door to the right, and that number will tell you to stay the same or go up. So of course numbers one through four, they tell you to stay. Um, and then five through nine tell you to raise. So sometimes it's a silly saying like, five or more, raise the score, four or less, let it rest. So because this is four or less, it rests, and this would round to a 17 as the nearest whole number. Now, if we wanted to round to the nearest tenth, here's another example, 18 and 28 hundredths. If it's asking me to round to the nearest tenth, I would underline that place value, look next door, and because this eight is five or more, it tells this number to go up. Just one digit, 18 and 3 tenths. We don't need to add a zero um, because it, be, it only wants us to round to the tenths. We need to stop right here. Then if we needed to round to the hundredths, Twenty-three and four hundred forty-five thousandths. If it, I need to round to the nearest hundredth, I underline my hundredths place value. I look next door to the thousandths, and it's five or more, so it tells this four to go up. So you keep everything the same, except now when you get to the hundredths place, you raise it one more. And you leave it because it's only asked you to round to the hundredths.